Hey crafty friends, it's Melissa. Welcome back to my channel. I know I haven't posted a video in a while, but um, and I haven't been doing a whole lot of crafting in the last week or so, but I wanted to share something with you guys that I recently um, received in the mail uh, and that I did a project with and I think it's absolutely adorable. This is not paper crafting, but the element of this is just adorable because it's like paper piecing I guess you're layering all your pieces together to create a project so this comes from paisley's and paisley's and polka dots and there is their website there I purchased three of these um, gingerbread cookie jar shaker kits and this is what you're essentially creating here this cute little ginger in a jar and it's really cool because not only do you get all the pieces that are paintable layerable all that fun stuff but they also send you this kit the i mean it's it's entirely ready except for like a little bit of paint they send you all the instructions they show you how to layer everything and then they send you pre-printed so you get your acetate for your shaker they send you the little elements do you see the lines so all you got to do is cut on the lines and layer it if you want to use these papers or you don't have to you can use your own papers but so they send you all the layering pieces and then they send you some options two different options for the ginger's body so you get one that's sort of on a um, gingham and then you get another one that's on a polka dot so I think it's really cool that they give you some options for this it's super super cute uh, it comes together fairly quickly because I mean there's not a whole lot to it but when you open this I'm not going to open this because um, the pieces are going to be everywhere and there's a lot of pieces in here so but basically you're getting all the pieces to create and I did one yesterday how cute is that you guys so you get the little cookies that come inside of it the layering cookies and the little gingerbreads and I did add some um, a little shaker mix in there that had some other things so in case you're wondering but is that not the cutest? Oh my gosh. I just absolutely adored this. Which y'all know I love gingers anyway. But um, I like to do, you know, my own little home decor. My own little um, tiered tray decorations and stuff. And just, I mean, who doesn't love to have cute gingies to display for Christmas? But this guy's really cute. And he's a pretty decent size. I mean, like, fairly large. Okay, so... This is seven inches tall, and he's just above that. I'm going to go out on a limb and say about seven and a quarter inches tall. Well, from the very bottom of the stand, it may be about seven and a half inches tall. But it's so, so cute. So I did layer mine up with the papers that came with it, but I may do a pink version, and I'll have to use some other papers for that. I'll probably use the, the little ginger parts and all that. Now, I have... A ton of acrylic paint pens which I used for some of it but for the red like I just used a regular uh, red paint acrylic paint I think it was folk art and I just dabbed it on with a little sponge no big deal so super easy and then like for the ginger I went around him with a little bit of ink to sort of shade it just a little bit it's really cool it's very dimensional you guys really really dimensional you're layering layer 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 it's really cool though the way it comes together and it looks so cute i cannot wait to display that so anyway i wanted to share that with you guys there's two other companies that i've been ordering similar things from i get a subscription box um and then i have ordered some from stacy's designs or something like that i'll link all three of the places below that i've been purchasing these type of kits from they're really fun and it's another craft to do that's kind of you know it's in our wheelhouse but it's sort of you know it's different so i thought i would share it with you guys just in case you were interested I hope you're all having a great day and had a great week and um, look forward to seeing you again soon. Happy crafting everybody.